Happy Sunday. I have an unboxing for you today. This is a box for a boy in the age range of 10 to 14. It's my first box for a boy 10 to 14 that I have unboxed this packing season of 2022. And my goal is to do a lot more of this um, age range for boys in 2022 because in 2021, I packed a total of 100 boxes, but only three of them were for boys 10 to 14. I find these the most challenging for me. And I always need a bigger box when I pack boys 10 to 14. And this is an oversized box. But I just wrote this down here because I wanted to remember to say that the theme of this box, it doesn't really have a theme. So I'm calling it my box that has things that spin, soar, bounce, roll, light up, and make noise. So let's get into it. When he, oh, and the box is, um, I didn't cover it except with a little bit of decorative duct tape to cover up the words on the top and then just to give it some interest around the sides and then reinforce the edges. He has, oh, and on the inside, I use sticker letters to put the phrase, Jesus loves you, and there's just a minion image there on the cover. And so, right on top, this is what you'll see. There is a frisbee on top and the inside spin. And these are hard to pack. You have to have a bigger, wider box to pack these. And I've had this a really long time because they're hard to pack. Um, but in this box, I was able to get it to fit. Um, I left the tag on, but I'll take it off um, to remind myself to tell you it was a dollar, I believe, in the dollar spot at Target. So this spins and soars. These are marbles. So these roll. I put them in this drawstring pouch. I believe this is a set of marbles that I got at um, by, by Below, I believe. A green washcloth. A toothbrush with a cap. This is a building set. Um, an airplane is what he can make with this kit. So, so something that soars um, and maybe rolls because it has wheels. I got this at the Dollar Tree. Bolts, Meccano bolts. I don't know about these. Are these good quality? If you've packed these or you know about these, let me know in the comments. Is this a good quality toy for a 10 to 14 year old boy? Looks like it looks challenging <laughs> to put together and it comes with all the tools. There was some extra room in the box. So I packed some Hot Wheels cars, things that roll. <laughs> so he's got a race car Hot Wheels, a camper van, and looks like a tow truck. So he's got some things that roll and then there's the contents of the kit. He has something that makes noise. This is one of those clacker toys. So something that makes noise to drive, you know, others around him nuts. Here is his outfit. We'll start with these cargo shorts that I got um, at Walmart, Wonder Nation. They're size extra large, 14, 16. I love cargo shorts for boys. They're thicker material, really good quality, extra pockets. And this has got um, an elastic waist, but it also has this um, belt, built-in belt um, that, you know, snaps or, or, you know, interlocks. So here's, and then to go with his shorts, this nice colored polo style shirt, button down shirt. It's also size extra large, 14, 16. I got this at Old Navy and I took the price tag off, but I believe I paid a dollar for this. I remember getting this and thinking it was such a good deal. So I don't know, I think this is a nice outfit. I mean, it is shorts, but if they're allowed to wear shorts to school, I think this is a really nice outfit for school. He has a pair of socks. He has a blue bandana. Take the cup out next. 
This is one of those larger cups. I got a few of these at Walmart. Um, I've shown these before. Great for a large box. And inside, I could stuff a lot of things. Extra batteries that will go with his light. This is a light that I got on clearance at Walmart. Um, I think it's a camping light. It has a logo of mountains and it says Cascade Mountain Tech on it. And this is a great light. This is $5 on clearance at Walmart. And as you can see, this is something that lights up. He's got two settings on the bottom and one light on the top, his light. He has his underwear stuffed inside the cup. I just put in one pair, I believe this is size extra large, 14, 16. And he has something that lights up and bounces. A spiky ball and he has something that you can toss or bounce on your knee a hacky sack ball it says faith on it I get those at Hobby Lobby he has something that makes noise a lip whistle some more things that bounce and roll these are little bounce balls that's what's in his cup there's the straw that goes with it so that is his cup, his tumbler cup. His little hygiene kit here, I have some soap. I have some band-aids, I have some lip balm. I have a couple of emery boards and nail files. Um, I have a toenail clipper and a fingernail clipper. He has a comb. He has a full size thing of dental floss. He has, let's see, I'll do this next. He has a full size backpack all rolled up, bound together um, to make it compact so it fits even in this bigger box. But this is really a good quality. I don't remember where I got it. Um, it is a pro sport. Um, I have different backpacks that I've gotten different places at different prices, so I'm not just I'm just not too sure um, he has his school supplies pouch I love using these because when I unbox and show you I don't have to open it and take everything out um, just all of our essential school supplies we like to put in um, he has a smaller set of Crayola crayons metallic eight count um, I liked the metallic crayons for this box because of the um, adult coloring book I have in here but I also have colored pencils so these two things together I think will be great for his coloring book uh, before I forget to mention it um, the family photo with the note on the back he has a journal um, actually just has blank pages in it and I hope this isn't too girly it's a happy planner I believe I got this on clearance at Dollar General it's either there or, or Dollar Tree um, but anyway I hope it's not too girly it's got some splashes of color on it and I think it'll be fine for a boy he's got a regular size ruler he has this book I tossed in a book it's a level three um, learning to read, but I thought it would be appropriate for a 10 to 14 boy um, because if he speaks English, English may likely be his second language. And so um, I think this is the um, perfect level for a, a boy 10 to 14. And it has all the structures from around the world, Statue of Liberty, Big Ben, Taj Mahal, the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Great Wall of China, so I love that. I got that at the Dollar Tree a while back when it was still a dollar. A notebook for school, just a regular spiral bound notebook. And here is this coloring book. I love this coloring book. I got this at Dollar General for 54 cents. I'll take that tag off, but I wanted to remember to tell you it's advanced coloring graffiti art. So perfect for a boy 10 to 14, right? I wish I had gotten more of these. Um, inside, you will, you will see images. Those are like, I believe, bottles of spray paint, graffiti. That says urban, um, urban life. That says sweet. And that one says fresh. 
And that one says, love, peace, live. It's got some peace symbols. That one just says graffiti. That one says sweet. That one for sure says sweet. That one says dance. Party. That one says break dance. Lots of great images of graffiti art, and so you can see why I included the metallic crayons as well as the colored pencils. And he has, this is the, I guess the wow item. Um, it's a desktop pool table. I got this on clearance at Hobby Lobby for $2.49. And so he has a nice flat surface here on top of his box, and it's big. So I think that'll work if he doesn't have a table or a desk for something flat. So these are things that um, roll, right? Um, and I stuffed inside the room in the box, so I was able to add some more things. A harmonica that makes noise. He has something that spins. A fidget spinner and makes noise because it's also a popper. Spins makes noise. He has a whistle to make some more noise on this cord along with a cross. And he has these fidget snap links. These kind of make noise. Kind of. And they kind of spin, I guess. <laughs> so I love these. I get these at five below. I I, pl I fidget with these all the time when I'm boxing and unboxing my shoe boxes. Here's the pool table, just to show you. There's the little pool table with the pool sticks. And I guess the little balls are inside there. I probably should double check. You know when things are on clearance, you never know. I just hate to take it out of the plastic. And I can't really tell by shaking it. So I will probably open this and just make sure that the, the balls are inside this pool table game. So that is my box for a 10 to 14 year old boy. And I think it turned out pretty, pretty good. So thanks for joining me today. And I hope you'll like, subscribe, comment. Until next time, I'll say goodbye for now. Thanks, friends. I added a couple things at, at the very end here. This bracelet that I made on my rainbow loom. It kind of looks like something that maybe a boy would, would wear. And then some stickers. These are some stickers. Uh, my daughter designed these images. And I purchased them from her Redbubble shop um, just on these big stickers. So these are really nice stickers. There's this very whimsical frog. There is a mushrooms and a snail. Here is a rocket ship soaring off into space. Here is a dragonfly. Here is a mushroom, a frog, and a dragonfly. Here is that dinosaur that I've showed before with all the flowers on it. Even for a boy, I'm going to put this in. And then this was just some a leftover piece that came off one of her sticker sheets. So um, I just wrote a note, draw your own sticker. And it is um, adhesive on there so he can make his own sticker. So that's my update. Bye for now.